Hi, this is question 10 in the ACT math practice exam I'm working through, and you've got a story problem here, a classic ACT story problem that they like to give you, especially within these first 10 questions of the ACT. So here we go. For building her garage, Helga needs three types of fasteners, 16 penny nails for the framing, 12 penny roofing nails for the shingles, and 14 penny finishing nails to put up road signs inside the garage after she finishes building it. Each fastener comes in a box, and each box holds 120 fasteners. The 16 penny box is two thirds full, the 12 penny box is one half full, and the 14 penny box is five sixths full. Altogether, how many fasteners are there in the three partially full boxes? All right, well, you know, if I were going to visualize this, I might, you know, just kind of think about I've got these three boxes, and I've got a you know, a 16 penny and a 14 penny and a 12 penny, and I know that, you know, maybe I call them ABC or something, and I've got, uh, let's see, the 16 penny box is half, I don't know, what is it, two thirds full, two thirds full, the 12 penny box is half full, this is the one that's half full, and the 12 penny box is five sixths full. Well, all right, well, I guess I can start off by just figuring out, uh, I know what half, I know all of these have 120 or parts of 120, right? So parts of 120, so we don't have exactly 120 in each, so two-thirds of 120, well, I can do that on my calculator. I can take, you know, 120 times two-thirds, or which is 0.6 repeating, and if I do that, I would get 80. So I know there's 80 nails in there. And then half of 120, I, you probably know, is 60. And then five-sixths of 120, again, I could just use do that on my calculator, and uh, one-sixth is... Uh, 100. So, or excuse me, 5, 6 is 100. 5, 6 of 120 is 100. So, then I could add these up and see what I get. Well, so that's 160 to 40. So the answer is K.